Mombasa. No, no, no. I, I am sufficiently informed, Mr. Speaker. Then proceed. You can see how I am proceed. prosecuting my points, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, the notion I want to correct, while I agree that the issue of disaster management is concurrent function, the, my good brother, the chair of Public Accounts Committee, has been reading daily to governors about the 2% emergency fund. But when it comes before the floor of the Mr. Speaker, Anaturuka, Mr. Speaker, the point I wanted to make, and I want to thank the President, and you had the governor of Nairobi yesterday, it is unanswered. He said national government has given in kind and in cash over 500 million to assist the people of Nairobi. We have the people of Nakuru, Mr. Speaker. We have the people that have been affected in Kilifi, Mr. Speaker. We must thank the national government and the president, His Excellency President William Ruto, for standing with the people. Mr. Speaker, he went even and prayed for the victims in Mayumayu, where my brother, my sister, the deputy majority leader, was there. He went to Madare himself. Senator Sifuna has not even gone to Madare, Mr. Speaker. He has not gone even Muguru Kwanjenga. There is Muguru Kwaruben, Mr. Speaker. Order, Senator he Fonaro. has never gone, Mr. Speaker. Senator then what can he Senator tell us? Fonandi, okay. Please, take your seat. Now, Senator for Nairobi, you know if you have a point of order, you know what to do. You need not shout. Okay? Senator Fonandi, conclude. Mr. Speaker, in conclusion on the issue let of disaster, the conclude. let me conclude on Senator Chute's, Mr. Speaker, in conclusion. As farmers, we are aware there are many abysides and acaricides that have been banned in the U.S. We have seen increased cases in Mandera, Marsabit, and even across the country. Mr. Speaker, when Bayern, uh, not Bayern Munich, Bayern AG, Bayern AG, Syngenta, and abysides, Mr. Senator Speaker. Senator Sifuna, what is your point of order? Mr. Speaker, on understanding one, uh, Order 105 on statements, uh, responsibility for statements of fact, is the Senator of Nandi sure about the things he's telling this House that I have not visited any of the places that have been affected by this flood damage? I know for a fact I have been there myself. So when he starts here, can he substantiate that Sifuna has not been to these places, Mr. Speaker? Senator for Nandi. If you're not sure about any facts, don't put them on the floor of the house. And on the particular matter, touching on the Honorable Senator for Nairobi, you alleging that he's not visited any of these sites. If you don't have, if you cannot substantiate that particular matter, proceed. Mr. Speaker, I didn't say, I mentioned three places. I didn't say he has not visited. My answer can bear me. I have said I am not sure if the Senator of Nairobi has visited Madare the way the President has visited. Senator Mr. Speaker, Nairobi, in conclusion. Senator for Nairobi, the Senator Fernandez is not sure. You may have, you may not have. Yes. Which is quite okay. Proceed and conclude, Senator I did learn proper English, Mr. Speaker, sir. Proceed. Mr. Speaker, sir, in conclusion, the issue of cancer. I am co-sponsoring a bill with Mwishmiwa Rahim Daoud on Cancer Prevention Amendment Act, and I'm happy you have approved, Mr. Speaker. We must work. In my farmers, we are using CN. We don't know the fake fertilizer, Mr. Speaker, if us have some cancer-causing agents. Maybe our only doctor in the house, Dr. Kalwale, will tell us, Mr. Speaker. So the point I'm trying to make, let the Committee of Health conclude this issue. And I want to, to, uh, to uh, call upon senators who have not visited their victims of floods to visit. And, and take pictures so that we can have record of their donations like Senator Professor Tomo Jenda. I thank you, Mr. Speaker. Senator Tomo Jenda. Point of order. Uh, th thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir. Mr. Uh, Speaker, Senator I... Ojenda, just a minute. What is your point of clarification, Senator Boni? Sorry, Mr. Speaker, to interrupt the proceedings. As you are uh, hearing, we are unable to con concentrate on debate. There's a lot of picketing out there, Mr. Speaker. And, Mr. Speaker, it has been happening every day we sit and have come to learn that those are doctors wanting to present a memorandum. Mr. Speaker, sir, could you please order the clerk or your deputy speaker or the leader of the majority to go and receive the memorandum so that they can go away? We continue with our business, Mr. Speaker. No, a, a, a whip whips members in the House. Senator Boni, 